Hey guys, Great Radio here. What's going on? Welcome back to another episode of Marvel Contest of Champions. And today we've got a four star hero crystal to open up. Now, it's taken a lot longer to get to this point to get a four star than it did the last one because we haven't been getting as many rewards as, uh, as we normally would where we switched alliances. So, thankfully, we're, we're finally there. I don't, uh, we're, we're off by just a little bit but I've got enough three-star hero crystals here that's gonna push us over the top and the fact that I've actually got a uh, max sig three-star crystal that that should probably you know be shards <laughs> I don't know anything else that it would be at this point uh, that's usually all we get so let's start off here we'll start with our, our lower crystals let's do the free crystals first Cause I want to save some of the the ones that actually have characters in them. Usually, I, I don't like do as good with this as I, I probably should on on putting everything out there. But so we get a bunch of crap out of the free crystals. Didn't really see anything in there too enticing. Let's get the two star. We'll go ahead and get the two star out of the way. Get another max sig crystal for a two star. What else have we got here? Versus crystals, we'll go ahead and get those out. Maybe get a two star punisher, not gonna happen. That's one two star that I don't have really maxed out all that much. 23 quest crystals. Pop those open. And mostly junk. The one uh, small energy. I mean, as as much as we get full energy revives on here, the small energy is actually coming pretty handy. So I'm I'm not going to complain about that. Let's do the uh, the daily crystals now. Pop those five open. One two star and ten units. Not too bad actually. Ten units. I don't think I I don't think I've ever got units out of a daily crystal before. So that's that's kind of cool. Black Bolt should actually add another crystal to us. So that's more three star shards. Let's actually open up this premium mirror crystal. Boom. Cap is not maxed out, so we don't add any more to that. I want to save these uh, these max seed crystals for last. That way I. That's not too bad. I like that. And really, it's the, that's about the only place you're getting anything now. Like, I don't really get too much out of these map 5 crystals as far as items go. So those War Victor crystals are definitely awesome for, for getting items. So open these six up. Just shards. Just shards. But those Cosmics come in handy because we're almost at three Cosmics now. That everything here, I believe it is. So let's get over here into the three star hero crystals. Let's open two of these ones up. Boom, boom, open. Perfect. That actually should put us over, I think. Hmm. No sick crystals though. So that stinks, but does that put us over? Nope. That's fine. That is perfectly fine. Let's do these two star. Open those four up, 220, and we have this one, as long as it's shorts, there it is. Now we have the four star formed, heck yeah, awesome. Let's pop this bad boy on. Now, pretty much like any other time that we do crystal openings, what I'm looking for is to awaken a champion that I have that is not already awakened or a new character altogether. Agent Venom or Crossbones would be absolutely awesome at this point. I love those guys. Haven't got them. Would love to be able to test them out and mess around with them. So let's see what we can get. Even Kamala Khan, you know, whenever characters end up going into the arenas, I get a little bit hyped about them. Because I know I'm not going to do the arena to do it. I've got too much stuff going on in real life to be able to, to sit down and actually play the arena. So, what are we going to 
God. Yellow jacket. That puts him at like 40, I think. So not a new character. Not one awakened that I didn't already have awakened. But it puts us closer to uh, the next five star, which is still a pretty good ways off. Like I said, we haven't been getting nearly as many uh, rewards here lately because of the fact that we switched alliances, so that kind of stinks. But as far as characters go, I think Yellow Jacket probably has one of the most useless signature abilities in the game, period. Yellow Jacket is an awesome character. Don't get me wrong on that aspect. He is an awesome character, but Biosting 2.0 is absolutely useless to me. Power Stings stun their victims with the bioelectric shock for 2.1 seconds after lasting their full duration. I don't want them to last. That's why I don't like that signature ability. I don't want those I don't want those bio stings to last. Those uh, those power stings, I mean. I don't want the power stings to last. I want them to pop one up to pop off a special. I specifically hit characters with bio sting, blast, and power sting whenever I know they have special attacks ready to go because I want them to pop them off because they're going to take a huge amount of damage from that so Biosting 2.0 is just it's it's completely pointless to me is it awesome whenever you get a stun if they don't yeah it's it's, it's pretty cool but I would prefer them not get the uh, the stun I want them to pop off their special so that they take more damage that's the key thing with Yellow Jacket. He doesn't hit like a Mack truck. He doesn't have the best health in the world. But by golly, if your opponent hits a special attack after you've hit them with one of your L1 or L2s, they're hurting pretty bad. So that's the whole point behind him. So I don't, I'm not really a big fan of Yellow Jacket Awakened. He doesn't, he doesn't need to be awakened. He never does, but I got the first two of these guys out of the, the original Yellow Jacket Crystals back in the day, and now we've got another one. So, not exactly the best crystal opening in the world, hands down, not the best, but alright guys, so that's, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If it's your first time watching the channel and you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a sub on it. If you did enjoy the video itself, leave a like on it. As always, guys, remember to like, share, comment, subscribe. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.